The Samurai event will help you to quickly earn a lot of coins, decorations, and TCIs. Similar event as the Nomad, but instead of the Khan camp, you get daimyo castles and townships. At the start of the event, choose a difficulty level, the highest possible that is unlocked. You can unlock it at Achievements by attacking the Samurai camps. I will choose the hard mode for now. The event can be divided into three parts, Samurai Camps, Daimyo Castles, and Townships. Your attack normally goes like this. First put booster tools in each wave, then a shield with ranged soldier in the first wave. This will score you a lot of points if you have enough tools. You can buy them from the Master Blacksmith, for example. In the second method, we don't go for points, only coins, and to increase the difficulty level. In this case, we only put shields in the first waves with ranged troops and launch as many attacks this way as we have extra troops in courtyard commanders. Let's see what this looks like in practice. The samurai shop is worth buying the following items. Tokens, siatas, decos, and TCIs. Sometimes the troops are good because they are fast. Today, five people could win a 10K food TCI for 28 days. Subscribe and like the video if you like it. Write in a comment how many highest points you have earned in Samurai Event, the server you play, and your username. Follow gge.guide slash advent. Tomorrow's video will be on Andre125's channel. Don't miss it. There are four different levels of daimyo camps. The two larger ones are worth attacking, the more you attack them, the stronger they get and the more points they give you as their war effort points increase. If you attack the level 4-1, it is recommended to attack with extra waves and yard bonus because it has a high yard count. It is also worth putting together an NPC commander. Tooling is the same as Samurai, easy to get in on the wall. The Samurai medals are 1.1 rate with points. They are worth buying tokens and Baramon tools with. Townships are also divided into four levels, so it's always worth taunting level four here. Unlike Khan, there is no need for rage points, just time skips. Here's how I defend against them. I recommend you put a castle commander against NPCs for less casualties. Also like Daimyo, they give you a samurai medals. Finally, activate combat strength bonuses with your clan. Hope you enjoyed the video. Good luck to everyone in the giveaway.